The Esteem Plus One Piece Ostomy Solution combines the comfort and freedom of flexibility with the firmness of convexity. Let's get started with the application. Step 1. Getting the right fit. If you have cut-to-fit skin barriers, be sure the cut-to-fit hole fits your stoma as close as possible. Consider using a pin to trace around your stoma in the barrier's cutting area. This will ensure proper sizing for your stoma. Then cut the hole you trace to fit the size of your stoma. It's important to not make the opening bigger than the outer ring marked max on the wafer. If you're using pre-cut skin barriers, simply select the skin barrier with an opening slightly larger than your stoma. Step 2. Applying the pouch. Warm the skin barrier in the palm of your hands for a few seconds. The heat from your hands will improve adhesion. Then slightly inflate the pouch by gently pulling the outside and inside to allow some air to enter the pouch. Now remove the clear release liner from the skin barrier by pulling away with the tab. Start the application by holding the skin barrier below your stoma. Starting from the bottom, carefully apply the skin barrier to the skin around your stoma. Smooth over the back of the adhesive area with your fingers and press carefully but firmly around your stoma. Step 3. Closing your pouch. We will cover closure for drainable and urostomy pouches. If you have a closed pouch, you can skip this step because your pouch is already closed. To close drainable pouches, simply fold the end up five times toward you until the interlocking closures line up. Press around the closure with your fingers to secure. If you wish, you can tuck the tail into the fabric cover for more discretion. To close the urostomy pouch, make sure the ribbed cork is securely pushed into the bottom of the drainage tap. Step 4. Emptying and cleaning your pouch. We will cover emptying and cleaning for drainable and urostomy pouches. Closed pouches will not need emptying since they will simply be removed and disposed of. Emptying your drainable pouch. It's important to tilt the tail up towards the ceiling. Peel open the closure and unfold the tail. Now point your tail end towards the toilet or receptacle. To open the tail, push both sides of the tail with your fingers to create an opening. You can also pull up on the tab to help open the tail. Allow the pouch to drain. To clean the tail end of the pouch, support the pouch with one hand and use toilet tissue to wipe the tail in a downward motion. Clean the inside of the tail by inserting rolled up toilet tissue and sliding the tissue back and forth inside the tail. Repeat until the tail end of the pouch is clean. Emptying your urostomy pouch. Simply tilt the tap up towards you. Hold the base of the tap with one hand, then pull out the cork with the other hand. Now point the tap opening towards the toilet. Step 5. Removing the pouch. Removal is basically the same for drainable, urostomy, and closed pouches. Using one hand, gently peel the skin barrier and pouch down and away. With the other hand, push down on the skin above the barrier to aid removal. To find out more, call 1-800-422-8811 to speak with one of our Me Plus specialists, or you can visit convitech.com.